we gotta come clean, we gotta tell the truth, and we gotta kinda give you an update. Morning, Brennan. We're going to Montreal, and we're so pumped. We're going to Montreal, we're so pumped! Ah! I'm feeling good about it, man. This is my homeland, guys. I'm half French. Hey. Fuck, man, I got fries my French. Apparently, he has French covered. Nous allons pour une trip à Montréal. Hey! Wait any longer now, I lose my cool. Never gotta think it all over now. I feel just like a fool. Good afternoon. We are about how many hours into our road trip? Like five. five like, hours in. like five. Like five hours into our road trip. We got like four left. Four hours left. Still yeah. A little over halfway. Sorry. So I'm trying to vlog about our snacks, but he just ruined it. So Tina, over here. I say, Tina, we need snacks for the road. And you hear what she does? She gets a giant ass bag of freshly picked. I went to Parks Blueberries with my grandparents and we picked a lot of blueberries. Next, we got our uh, bag of water, straw, juice box, pocket avocados for later. You never know when you're going to need an avocado. Yo, we're parked right now, basically. We're parked in the middle of the highway. We got traffic jams all the way. Holy fuck. It's disgusting. Tia, tell them I'm about- I'm so over it. <laughs> I don't even want it. <coughs> I got a whip. <laughs> Yo, we're in the middle of traffic, but I don't even give a shit. Tina, hold this. Bro, do you have to get that, get out of the car for that? Uh, what? Oh my god, man. We've been in this traffic jam for three hours. Three hours, guys! Three hours, you assholes! <laughs> Dita's bladder has had enough, and uh, <laughs> she's definitely had enough of my uh, my bowels. <laughs> If I gotta take all I've got and take it to you If I got to tell me where to Babe. I'm tearing up. I'm so excited. So excited. Oh my god, there's a big orange. What the? What? The? Holy shit, I'm just realizing now that we're in French country, Tina. We're in French country. You're you're screwed. I'm fucking screwed. You're screwed. Know. Um, bonjour, uh, bibliothèque, eh, le trafic, um, Australian barbecue and just give up, just give up. You're done. Um, You're done. You're done. I'll take care of you. Bien. Just follow me. Uh, <laughs> merci, merci, except vehicle autorisé. Um, oh man, we're outdoors. We're here. <laughs> finally, checking out this uh, Airbnb for the first time. Yo, we think we're here, but like it says 13, but it says 9. Let's look for a 13. What? Oh, is this it? This is it. She just pumped. Oh, well, it's kind of cute. It's nice. Yo, we actually made it to our first ever Airbnb. Bear, 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 bear. I've never done this before. I've never been in any of these before. But uh, Tina, give us the tour. A cute little view. <laughs> cute view, she says. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Hold up, we're coming at you right now from the future. We just gave you the tour of our Airbnb, but we're actually at our second Airbnb of our vacation, but you don't need to know that yet. Uh, just stick around for the next week or two worth of vlogs. It's gonna be amazing. But anyway, we had to kind of real quick, we gotta come clean and we gotta tell the truth and we gotta kind of give you an update on us and our van life <laughs> journey. Uh, we didn't get the van. 
We're not getting fan right now. Basically, we couldn't get a loan, so it's not happening. Yeah, we're too young and our credit's pretty bad, so it's like, uh, it's just first we're running into trouble with the insurance and then we're running into trouble getting a loan. So it just makes more sense for the two of us right now to put this kind of van life dream on hold for like a few months at least until we can come up with the money to just buy a van outright and just make it work that way for us. And honestly, at first we were both pretty bummed about it because we were so set on that van. Like everything about that van felt like the universe was saying, buy this van. Um, but I guess what it really was for us was a learning experience. We got to go through the whole trial run without actually buying the van. So mm. it's pretty cool because now we come out of this experience with a better knowledge of what we need to, to, to do this. And especially now that we're on vacation, like yeah. traveling. So it's like, it's a good chance for us to be like travel for two weeks and realize, okay, this is what we need for our van. And that was not the van. If we'd have bought that van guys, we'd have never been able to park anywhere. It was way too big, but we were just caught up in the moment and we ha we wanted it, you know, but in reality, it was not the right one for us. Patience is key when you're buying a van. We've learned. Yeah, definitely. So sorry guys, we'll have to wait to be a van lifers, but in the meantime, sorry, not sorry. Yeah, so then, guys, who put so much pressure on us to be... <laughs> we do it for ourselves. Yeah, kind of, I guess. But you know what? Like, seriously, we love you guys. Like, thank you for supporting us in this whole process. Our friends, our family, you guys. Yeah. Um, All the advice we've got from even, like, the dealership that we went to. Like, Scott, Chad, everyone who helped us out at Campbell's Toyota. You guys were fantastic. Mm -hmm. Very patient with us, even mm -hmm. though we're young and stupid. No, don't tell me, gosh. Anyway, <laughs> Tina, stay tuned for future vlogs. We may buy a van someday. We might. We will. <laughs> Why are you saying might? We will. Anyway, <laughs> look, we're going to throw it back to past Bren and past Tina. What the f? We're basically, we're just going to stay in tonight at the Airbnb. We got into town too late with the traffic jam and everything. So it makes more sense for us to just sleep tonight, wake up early tomorrow morning, go do some crazy shit. We're gonna do some fun shit tonight. Yeah, so subscribe to our video.